Hello, I'm Jerry Ford. I'm going to review an, the, um, another bag of the Siete um, potato chips, or tortilla chips, sorry. Um, this is the last one I got. I can't remember if there was other ones at Walmart or not. <clears throat> I'll have to look and see. These are interesting and really good tasting uh, tortilla chips. But this is the ranch flavor. They're grain-free tortilla chips made with 100% av avocado oil. The dairy free, paleo, and vegan. Um, <clears throat> so let's see. Um, the ingredients you got some cassava flour, avocado oil, coconut flour, nutritional yeast, coconut milk powder, ground chia seed, sea salt, garlic powder, lactic acid, onion powder, citric acid, dill weed, and parsley powder. Okay. Grain-free, gluten-free, paleo, and vegan-friendly, made with avocado oil, dairy-free, soy-free, no corn, wheat, or rice. I've been reading this story for every video in case, you know, let's just say you don't watch the other two, you just watch this one. And you'll miss this, this really good story here. This is uh, the Siete story. <clears throat> A few years ago, all seven Siete members of the Garza family began exercising together and adopted and adopted a low exercise, a low inflammation, grain-free diet to support Veronica, their sister and daughter, who was diagnosed with multiple autoimmune conditions. Going grain-free meant that this third-generation Mexican-American family from South Texas could no longer eat many of their favorite foods. So Veronica began to, be, to create grain-free dishes her whole family could enjoy. When their grandma, Campos, said that Veronica's first creation, a grain-free almond flour tortilla tasted better than her own homemade flour tor tortillas, the family realized they had something special. With their grandma's stamp of approval, Siete was born. Abuela approved. Okay. Cool. Here's the, here's the family. I don't know if you can see it very good or not. It's not real clear on the bag either. But Okay, well, let's see. Now, the other two that I've done, there's not a huge aroma um, that comes out of them. It's mostly just uh, the, the taste. The taste is big, but the aroma is not. <coughs> yep, same, almost the same exact aroma. Except you do get a little bit of a ranch aroma. <coughs> there's a, there's a, um, a very, very light powder coat on there. Um, and you can see the little bit of um, um, the little... Uh, Let's see parsley powder onion powder garlic powder it's probably a little bit of all the I'm gonna say that it's the what I can see there is probably maybe some the dill weed <clears throat> or the parsley powder and you see those little flicks in there Oh, those are really good. Um, like I say on the other ones, the, uh, the, the texture, you know, the crunch is different from, let's just say, Doritos. Um, it's a little softer. There's a little crunch, but it's not huge. Um, get the flour. <clears throat> Coconut flour, probably. Coconut milk. Okay, see. Cassava flour, probably. That's the taste I think I'm getting. Not very good. Not good. 
tangy ranch taste to it. Um, <clears throat> a little bit of garlic. Um, a little bit of onion. I think I'm getting more garlic than I'm onion. Really good. So there you go. A good product. All right, let me know if you've tried this one. Okay, I'm going to end it there. I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.